Hey there everybody, welcome back. I am the Gerbil and in today's video we're going to look at tier 3 of the GLA unlock. In this one you need Rolo. I've got her modded at 297 speed, which is pretty good. A lot of potency. Damage at 20... was that? 8,100. R2, mine is over the top, way over the top, 330 speed, 104,000 health, uh, 6,100 uh, offense. Lando Calrissian, he's kind of crappily modded, 218 speed, a mere 6,500 offense, so nothing there to write home about. And Chu Pio is fabulous at 291 speed, 86,000 health. Uh, a lot of, um, uh, well, decent tenacity, I guess, 71%, and 10,300 offense. That is really good offense, but realistically, you could push him a lot higher. Now, my R2 is Relic 9, but here's the good news, boys and girls. You don't need this good of characters in Tier 3. It's actually pretty simple. Pat yourself on the back for getting through Tier 2. I mean, really? Tier 2 was a challenge. It was a real pain, but this one, not so much of a challenge. Now, again... I've got some really, really good mods on here, and I do recommend you remod them, but look how fast we are already tearing through these, these enemies. I recommend trying to gun down Boba Fett in Phase 1 before you concern yourself with the Stormtroopers, because he's pretty squishy, and you can get through him pretty quickly. Remember YOLO, uh, you do want some good potency on her, and but more importantly, I think you want critical chance on her. In Tier 2, you wanted a whole bunch of tenacity. That's not really needed so much in this one. Boba Fett could land uh, ability block, um, but I mean, like, really, look how slow the opponents are going. They are incredibly slow. So I think if you mod your characters for maximum speed and offense even at lower like whatever the minimum relic levels are to unlock GLA like I think for R2 I think you do need him at relic 8 so I mean come on 9 he's a support unit you're only getting like an extra 250 damage or something out of him so mod your characters for maximum offense and speed I think speed primarily followed by offense followed by potency so that you can get the stuns on R2's basic so that Rolo lands the ability blocks but keep in mind her, her mass is Hit, her best AoE has to land multiple hits on each enemy to land the ability block and it attacks 10 times so it's pretty easy in phase one when you only have two stormtroopers and, uh, and uh, Boba Fett but you also want that crit chance because the critical chance for each crit she lands it reduces the cooldown of her AoE same goes for Lando I don't I don't have his kit like memorized he's kind of not a very good character in the game um, so he doesn't get used often but his AoE once upon a time was meta it really was boys and girls now it's like meh but I do believe for him it's it says for each, uh, if he lands three critical hits or more, I think, or something, then it resets the cooldowns, all right? So you do want critical chance on Lando, you want critical chance on Rolo, you want health and speed and potency on R2-D2, of course, some of that gets shared with your allies. And then on Chupio, I, I really recommend just as much offense as possible because he shares his offense with the team, similar to where R2 shares his max health, protection, potency, and something else, I don't remember, maybe offense. But so Chupio, what he does is he takes 40% of the stats from your leader for himself, gains, I mean, he doesn't he doesn't remove it from the leader, he, he adds 40% of their stats to himself. Then he distributes, I think, half of that uh, back out to the team. So the more offense you put on Rolo, the stronger Chupio gets, the stronger the whole team gets. See, eh, once again, just walked right through Boba Fett. This one, I, I, I really think most people, you should be able to just kick back and enjoy this one. If, if you do lose, um, feel free to blame me. It's okay. I'll take the, the heat on that. If it makes you feel better, especially just be like, yeah, it's all Gerbil's fault. We're good. I feel like I'm getting blamed a lot these days for... Um, Mrs. Gerbil. But that's okay. It's just life, right? We're all good. So, yeah, blame me. I don't mind. Oh, hey, look, everybody. We're shooting the sky in a building. I wish, like, you could see, like, falling debris, like, come down and, like, wonk, wonk, hit him on the head, and then, you know, 
do some extra like damage. I don't know. That would be kind of funny, wouldn't it? So, um, let's see here. What else to say about it? Chu Pio is probably your beefiest character, in, uh, or R2, so you smoke to put everyone but maybe those two in stealth. Rolo's your squishiest, so you might want to protect her, but the enemies just aren't going to take a team if you mod for speed. Seriously, they're not going to take a team. All right, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. Hit that like and subscribe down below. Pretty please with sugar on top. <laughs> I'll catch you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>